he promised us. Zero cuts out of the state general revenue for education. But it wasn't true. Republican Senate candidate Rick Scott is in the crosshairs of this political commercial from the Senate Majority Pack. It makes a lot of claims about our two-term governor in a short amount of time, so pay close attention. On that first claim that Scott broke his promise not to cut education funding, our exclusive West 2 News Truth Meter rates that claim true. On that first promise made by Scott, my source is me. He cut $1.3 billion from K-12 education. Yup, that was from a report I did on Scott's 2014 opponent, Charlie Crist. Just as Chris pointed out, Scott did cut $1.3 billion from K-12 education, but he blamed part of that cut on the loss of federal education dollars. And gave tax breaks to corporations instead. Did Rick Scott give tax breaks to corporations? Of course. True. He promised that from day one. We will reduce the business taxes from 5.5% to 3%. Scott cut $20 million from pre-K, slashed Bright Future scholarships. The truth meter on both of these claims rings true. You can see it in headlines in publications in 2011 for the pre-K cuts and in 2014 for the cuts in Bright Future scholarship money. And this claim? And over a thousand teaching jobs gone. The truth meter is going to ring false on that statement. Educators I've talked with have provided no hard proof with real numbers to substantiate the loss of teacher jobs in 2011 that could be directly attributed to Scott. Today, Florida schools have fallen to 40th in the nation. It is true that pre-K-12 schools are ranked number 40 in the nation, but hold on. It's false when you include higher education. Take a look. U.S. News & World Report ranks Florida number one in higher education, and all factors considered, Florida education is ranked number seven. The Scott campaign has branded this commercial twisted because it fails to mention that education funding is now at its highest level. Scott has cut taxes dozens of times, realizing $10 billion in savings to help create jobs. Well, now you know. With the Truth Test, I'm Greg Fox. And you can see more Truth Tests and candidate debates moderated by Greg on West.com's Commitment to 2018 page.